Welcome to Sora Sweet Delights. Today I'm going to show you another brownie recipe and it's black and white brownie and we are going to make it without oven and with whole wheat flour. It's very healthy. So let's see how to make it. Let's see the ingredients. We will require whole wheat flour 1 cup and instead of whole wheat flour you can also make use of maida or all purpose flour in same amount. Here is sweetened condensed milk half cup. Here is a dark chocolate. I have chopped it into pieces and it is 1 cup. Here is white chocolate. Again I have chopped it into pieces. This is more than 1 fourth cup. Here is some melted butter. This is 80 grams. And here is curd 1 fourth cup. Here are a few white chocolate chips. Uh, you can take this as per your requirement. I have taken here a 1 fourth cup. This is vanilla extract, half teaspoon baking soda, 1 fourth teaspoon baking powder, half teaspoon. You all know that I normally bake in a vessel, this aluminium vessel. And I have placed it on a medium to high flame for 10 minutes for preheating. And inside I have placed one stand or ring on which we are going to place our uh, cake tin or the brownie tin. Here in another vessel I am going to melt my dark chocolate. You can also make use of microwave. Here I am using the double boiler method. Below I have placed one vessel in which there is some water, one fourth filled. And on that I have placed my bowl. And you can see the chocolate has started melting. We will melt it completely. You can see here our chocolate is perfectly melted and now we will mix our other ingredients. We will add in our butter, then curd and condensed milk. And we will just mix this all well. We have mixed our mixture well and you can see it's nice and chocolatey and now we are going to add in our vanilla extract and again we are going to mix this well. Now we are going to sift our dry ingredients our wheat flour, baking powder and baking soda directly into this uh, mixture. After sifting our flour, we are gently going to mix this together. You can see here, our batter is ready now. And now we are going to add our white chocolate to this. And instead of this uh, bigger chocolate chunks, a chopped one, you can also add uh, chocolate chips. But I like this bigger chunks in my brownie. And also I am going to add few walnuts because I love walnuts in my brownies. This is completely optional. You can skip the walnuts. And now again I am going to fold this all really well. Here I am having one brown cake tin and I have lined it with butter paper. And on that I have applied little oil or you can also apply little butter and dry flour. And now we are just going to add a batter to this. You can also make use of square tin. You can see here, I have spread it my batter evenly in a thin layer. If you take small tin, you will get a bigger width of your batter. And now on top of this, I am going to add white chocolate chips. Since the name of our brownie is black and white, we are just going to make it beautiful by adding this white chocolate chips just give a gentle tap two three times and now it's ready for baking you can see we have placed our tin inside and now we are going to cover the lid of this vessel and we are going to uh, bake this on low flame for 20 minutes initially after 20 minutes we will just insert the skewer and check it is 20 minutes now we will just insert a skewer and we will check uh, it is little moist in middle and we will just cover this and bake for more 10 minutes. We will just check our skewer has come out clean and the baking time depends upon the size of your vessel and also the size of the tin but normally it gets baked uh, within 30 minutes. 
we will let this cool for some time and then we will unmold it and cut it into squares you can see here we have unmolded our brownie and now gently we are going to take this butter paper off and now I am just going to flip this you can see here we have unmolded our brownie and we have got nice crust and from here also it's uh, quite soft and moist and now I am going to cut squares our yummy brownies are ready and you can see the white chocolate inside 